Hey everyone, hey everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats, and we are in the middle of Jet's Pizza Week here on Five Minute Eats. If you want to know all about that, go check out our first video on it. We did their Jet's bread, but today we have our first pizza offering from them, and it is much like the Little Caesars deep deep dish because they are a Detroit pizza company, and this is their eight corner, and we got cheese and pepperoni and bold pepperoni. So that's something different with Jets. They have two different kinds of pepperoni. So you've got regular and bold, I guess. What so, is the difference? I guess we're gonna find out. I'm guessing this is the bold. The one that's cupped? Yeah. I think so too, probably. Now here's the thing, this is eight pieces. This is one piece. Now here is what our pizza looked like whenever we opened up the box of it. And then here is the close up version of it so you can really see all of those toppings. Now this was $22.55. So it is almost double the cost of a comparable Little Caesars pizza. This is really expensive. So that makes me a little hesitant on ordering from here again because yeah let's face it man that's a lot of money because if you go to Domino's what is it like five bucks $5 yeah $5.99 for a medium I believe yeah and that's pretty filling and so guys if you're new to our channel basically we review everyday grocery items and sometimes fast food and so before you guys spend your hard-earned money let us tell you if it's worth it that's right and FYI we have done these pizza weeks for almost every other pizza chain out there, at least the major ones, so definitely check those out in the archives. But this pizza, it looks very cheesy, I'll give them that. And it doesn't look like the crust is like overdone or anything, so it seems like it might be okay, right? If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. Hey guys, I'm ready. I'm ready. So our rating system, thumbs up, we would buy this again, thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a thumbs down and I actually like the pizza, it's really good. The price, it's the price, man, that's a deal breaker because it's super expensive. Now regarding the pizza, I like this a lot and the reason is the crust. It's as soft as a slice of bread. It's really soft like that, which is good because I felt like the Detroit style from Little Caesars, it's hard to eat because it's so crunchy. Mm. Whereas this one, you could just eat several slices very quickly because it just, goes in easily, man. It's mm. just, there's not much to chew. The cheese, it's very cheesy, I like that. There's a lot of sauce on there, which if you guys don't know, we love a lot of sauce. Pepperoni, it's really good. I like the bold. Mm. So I like both, and I would probably order, if I ordered a pepperoni, it would be like that, with both of them on there. Mm. It's a good pizza. Wow, oh wow. Okay, so I would just like to, um reiterate right here that our rating system is would we buy this again do we like it enough to buy it again and so for that reason I will say that my rating is a thumbs down because of the price I would not buy it again I would just go for a little Caesars because quite honestly for $23 we can get from our local like craft pizzeria, yeah, like a, a humongous pizza, and it's really, really good also. Like a mom and pop pizzeria, yeah. owned by Italians and all that kind of stuff. And so that's the reason, man, because this is pretty pricey. It's good, but it's, is it great, worth going out of your way? And now, spending almost $25. Exactly. So here's, here's my rating of the actual pizza, though. This is really good Detroit-style pizza. I'm with you on everything. The Little Caesars one, while I like that because it is a cheap, like, just good pizza, the crust on this is so much better because it is very light and fluffy. I felt like my jaw did not get a workout doing it. I also love the fact, this is a, a fresh piece that we put on here, but see this like nice little golden kind of crust on there? It is just soaked with like buttery goodness. It is amazing tasting and it's just the nice like, like balance of crispy and soft but not crunchy. So this is great. I loved the sauce on the pizza. I don't know if it's the same with the breadsticks or not, but I feel like on the pizza it works a lot better if it is the same. The cheese is really good. I feel like individually, I didn't particularly love either pepperoni. I felt like they were just okay. But when you get a bite with both of them together, I feel like is where it really like comes through. It's a good tasting pepperoni. So I'm with you. I do think that you need to order both at once. And that way you have the balance of both of them coming together. 
but for the price, I feel like I just can't justify it. And here's something that I wanted to add. If you go to Costco, you can actually get Motor City Pizza. So their pizzas are Detroit style. So you can get for, I believe, about $12, two of them, and they're just as good. And it's pretty much this exact same size also. It may be like an inch smaller, but the cost, man, the cost. I wish that they could get the cost a little bit better because honestly, I've heard of Little Caesars. I've never really heard of Jet's Pizza until it was recommended to us by a subscriber. So I feel like how do they justify the cost? So guys, to sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down, but good pizza. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.